We looked in the last video at um, how there are two different types of uh, division symbol in BB6. Um, so we know that uh, 3 forward slash 2 um, will give us a uh, definite exact um, answer um, with all the decimal places. Um, so 3 divided by 2 is 1.5, so we get 1.5. Whereas if we do uh, 3 divided by 2 with a backslash, we only get the whole number of times that 2 um, divides into 3. And uh, that's called a integer division. So we basically we just don't get the decimal places. We don't get the um, fractions on the end. What you may sometimes wish to do is display this answer and also the remainder. So 3 divided by 2 is 1 uh, remainder 1, isn't it? So um, how do we do that in VB6? Well, um, here's my uh, integer division uh, with the 3 and the backslash and the 2. And then I've got another line here which I'm just going to uh, put back in, which basically appends um, something else to the um, answer. So we've got LBL answer caption, which will currently be 1, equals um, LBL answer dot caption, 1, so it still equals 1. But I also want some text which says space remainder space. And also I want to do this piece of VB6 maths, which says 3 mod 2, and that will just give me the remainder of 3 divided by 2. So let's try it out. 3 divided by 2 now is remainder, uh, sorry, 1 remainder 1. And there are lots of different ways you could do this. You could have a variable that um, you set to equal that uh, and build that into your string. Um, uh, let's just step through it as well. Let's just do that. So remember, we were putting on the breakpoint, uh, hitting the equals lbl answer.caption currently equals nothing. Uh, until we step onto the next line using F8 on the keyboard. So now LBL answer.caption equals 1. Um, we can do things like highlight that text and do Shift and F8, sorry, Shift and F9 on the keyboard and it tells you the answer of that. Uh, we can do things like this down here to see what sort of thing we're going to get and now lbl answer dot caption is one remainder one 